Welcome back. Today I'm going to show you what you guys have all been waiting for. We're going to show you where the Model T ended up. There it is, right there. There's the Model T. Just kidding, that's the hood. But the hood's pretty flimsy. So we don't, we don't really want to mess with it too much, but we don't know if, once we're done with it, we don't know if we're going to put it back on or not. But for now, we have it off so we can look at the engine and everything. So this is kind of our shed full of just randomized parts and stuff. And mopeds. The Honda that I rode for a couple of years. A lawnmower. There's the QT. There it is. The actual Model T, not just the hood. No. It's in really good shape for the year and how long it sat. We got that on dollies right now so we can move it around pretty easily and see. The hood, I took the hood off as you've seen in the shed. And then we gotta get thin coils and there's a distributor. The engine's not stuck. So we should be able to get it running and stuff after we do all the normal tune up stuff. And we'll see where it goes from there. When the, well, the windows are still intact and everything. Except for these side windows. We don't know if I have any in there or not, but they're they're not there anymore. We're gonna get some eventually. But we're gonna run it stock for a little while. And just get it fixed and then like all these little spokes. Some of them are broken. I think my dad counted 13 of them. So we gotta get four tires. You can see they're rotted out, as you'd expect. But like the car's got a little bit of rust, but there's not much. There's a lot of body filler and mud on it, and a couple of dents. Here's the trunk. And then this hole right here, we think is just a battery plate. So we're gonna make a new one, and then there's a battery box right there. But all the windows still intact and everything. But the, the seat was originally up here and none of us would fit in it, so we're gonna, the seat was all rotted and everything. Probably take this tray out back here and then put our seat right there so we can reach, or not reach, so we can fit. And then just clean everything up. And the, the roof's like two plywood pieces, we think. We'll just make a new one of those. Maybe a radiator cover up top and everything. And then, Eventually, we're probably gonna tint these 20%, and I think the car is gonna be white. That's what color my dad wants it to be. But, yeah, should be a fun project and everything. Once we get it all tuned up, we have headlights and everything for it. They're actually over there. I'll show you in a little bit. But, like, to the passenger side, just same amount, normal rust over here. And then that, the spokes over there, ride it out. Like there's a couple of them on each wheel, I think. Actually, this wheel looks pretty solid. I think this is the best one we have. We're still gonna get tire for it. And yeah, I'll show you the headlights over here. This box has spare parts in it, but the headlights in here, over here. If I can get it open. front there right there where them two holes are and tail lights we gotta get new ones of those I don't know if we're using these headlights or not but we have them if we do yeah. should be a fun little project Here's the bumpers for the Mini. I had melted my original bumper, so I made new ones. Uh, just some steel. I'm gonna bolt those on, I'll show you that in a later video. But yeah, this one's for the Model T. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please subscribe, like the video, and see ya.